Welcome back to another video. Today is Monday. It's been raining for the past three days. It rained Saturday, it rained Sunday, and it's raining now. So what happens when it rains? A lot of leaks. This is a previous customer. We did a repair already, and she calls us back. So let's go find where it's leaking from. Let's talk less and fix more roof. If I see any readings. That's just like part of the thing. Or? Yeah, no, I'm not getting readings. Is there access to, yes, to there the is. attic? Yes, there is. Okay. All right, I'll have to get up there and see what's, what's going oh, okay. on. So he was just up there too. The light had gone out. So now we are just up in the attic. We were able to locate the leak is somewhere around this area. So I'm going to start moving the insulation, get it in there and see uh, where if I can see it, where is it coming from? Um, come on, let's go. So we got to be really careful because there's solid right here and solid right here. Right here is the drywall. If I step in there, we're going to go right through. So I got to be really careful not to go through the drywall because we would cause a bigger problem. So bear with me and let's do this. <coughs> See nothing. Ugh. What I'm looking for over here is see if I see anything wet. But so far. Right here. We were able to find a leak. This is it right here. So and now let me show you with the Thermal imaging camera, you see that blue? It's right there. So that's what's causing the leak. A misplacement, misplaced nail. <coughs> that's fiberglass. So now we gotta go back outside and figure this out. So now we're just up into the attic and doing a better inspection. So if you see that right there, and this one, and this one, there's a little stain around the nails. So if you take a closer shot right here, I mean, right there, see how those nails are rusted? It's because there is humidity up into the attic. There's not enough uh, ventilation, air coming in, air going out, and that's why they're getting rusted. So I'm gonna let the homeowner know that they don't have the proper ventilation, see what she wants to do, and we go from there. They do have baffles. That's the baffle right there. You see the styrofoam? There is a gap, oh, right here, that's better. There is a gap between the plywood and uh, the plywood and insulation to let the air come up into the attic. So air come in and air has to come out. I don't see the exhaust. They should have Richmond, but there is nothing. So I'm gonna let the homeowner know. Yesterday I did another emergency service and luckily I had this where it says applies in cold temperatures and wet surface so that's this is the right ceiling for what we got going on it's a little drizzle so we're gonna get up there and take care of this real quick i have everything that i need on my tool belt so let's go this customer gave us a call because we have done work in this house when she bought it. You guys can see it's newer shingle. The shingle is all beat up. The problem is right here. Look what's happening. See all that built up? Right. Right in there, that's what's causing leak. All that dirt. Look. All this and then water is coming in right in here below. So that's what I'm going to check. Sorry guys, I did a wrong diagnose. So, um, 
there's two nail holes, one here and one here. They didn't have no ceiling, they didn't have nothing. So that's where the water is coming in. So this one, it was of this nail and it was sealed. This one was because of this nail sealed too. So I'm gonna seal those two and that will fix this leak. That's it guys, that's what's causing the leak. Customers should be good now. So if you like what you see, let us know. Please help us with a like, comment, subscribe, and check this video out every Wednesday and Sunday. We'll do new videos. Thank you guys.